Imagine thousands of years ago, the pressure building up in the Earth's crust, and a volcano pushes its way up from the depths through the surface of the ocean, and then it blows itself to pieces. That's what we've got here, the remnants of an ancient volcano. A place in New Zealand which is washed by tropical warm currents from the north and cold currents from the south, where you get this huge diversity of animals not found anywhere else on the planet. And that's where we're going to dive, right here, the Poor Nights in New Zealand. In this ancient volcano, there are pockets of gas that just explode and blew holes in the side of the volcano. And that's why you get these huge caves. In fact, this cave is one of the biggest caves in the whole southern hemisphere where you can actually take a boat inside. And that's what we're going to do. Not many places in the world can you take a boat inside a volcano. What makes this place so special is that the caves and archways we are experiencing are also found underwater. I can't wait to film the creatures of the deep here. We will need powerful lights to explore these dark undersea canyons. I jump in with my heavy camera and lights and immediately wish I'd packed a dry suit. The 14 degree water temperature stuns my senses. but I'm soon distracted. Something big is moving in the kelp below me. It's a four meter long eagle ray. The ray's fins allow her to fly over the kelp like a giant black bird. We swim into a huge canyon Schools of Mayo Mayo hover in the half light. Deeper inside, my lights illuminate the plankton, the food source of countless marine animals. Exotic long-nosed boarfish and boldly striped wrasse thrive within the caves of this ancient volcano. The poorly named pigfish rivals the striking colours of the sponges with its crimson red scales. While waiting patiently on the volcanic rocks is the highly venomous scorpion fish. He will ambush anything that he can fit in his huge mouth. This undersea canyon supports an abundance of living, breathing life. The sponges, anemones and soft corals compete for space and decorate the sheer walls of the cave in brilliant colours. Then we discover a spectacular animal that Mother Nature has painted in the most striking patterns. It is a nudibranch or shellless mollusk. These beautiful creatures feed on stinging anemones. Their poisonous diet makes their flesh toxic to predators. Nudibranchs are hermaphrodites. They're both male and female. 
This allows them to mate with any nudibranch of the same species they meet.